20 days of chair. Just not consecutive. Oh, you're on 20 stream streak. Nice. All right, so this quest is down. I just got to go to a school in Moonbrook over here. But let's go do our walking simulator for this Stalvin quest, which I think leads to another elite kill in Darkshire, I think. You're disappointed in the short flight, huh? <laughs> Ooh, I wonder if these buzzards drop. Something I need for... For cooking. Because this is something I could do off stream. Um, tough condor meat. Do you drop tough condor meat? They drop eggs. Which... I can't get any more skill ups from. Okay. I wonder if uh, farming some of these... Low level buzzards in Westfall would be worth doing off stream for some cooking training to uh I need to get my cooking up a little bit higher I might have to do that tonight or tomorrow kill some birds for their meat so I'm curious if anyone in chat here has actually Successfully gotten a level 60 character in Hardcore Classic. And I'm pretty sure we have at least a couple people here who remember a lot of these old school quests. And so I'm guessing we probably have one or two people who, who have done that. I think this, this big building is a schoolhouse over here. How's a salmonella bar? It's not salmonella. <laughs> but it's delicious. Uh... I have the non-salmonella version, so no worries about salmonella. I think it's in here. The thing we're looking for. Are there any mobs guarding it? This looks like the schoolhouse. Um, I'm assuming I'm looking for something to loot in here. Uh, travel to the Moonbrook schoolhouse and bring back any updated information. Let me know if you get any updates on this fellow. I'll keep the records clean. This has got to be the schoolhouse, right? Maybe this is the town hall. Aha! Old footlocker. Take the dusty unsent letter to Clerk Daltrey. Oh! Forlorn spirit. To a not in matters of the past, Risen. You don't tell me what to do, spirit. I am metal where I want to metal, lady. You leveled a warrior in six to 60 in both vanilla and classic when it came out. You don't have it in you to do it a third time. I don't blame you. Definitely not for a warrior anyway. All right, uh, Paul, if you're here, um, I think our next quest is at Raven Hill. Paul, do you want me to go turn in this Legend of Stalvin thing to get up to where you are, or do you want to just meet at Raven Hill? Because I don't know how much walking simulator I'm going to have to continue doing till I'm up to where you are with the Raven Hill thing. You want me to turn in? Okay, all right. Then I'll fly from Sentinel Hill, Sentinel Hill back to Duskshire, because that clerk's in Dusk Duskshire. There's a lot more walking for it, though. Okay. I have a feeling the run from Darkshire to Ravenhill is so long. It might actually be faster to fly to Sentinel Hill and then run east to get to Raven Hill from Darkshire, I wonder. It's up to me if I want to do it on stream. Um, well, I'll meet you in Darkshire. I'll turn it in. I'll see what the next thing is. I'm leaning towards more I'd rather do combat stuff on stream over... Uh, I can't decurse that, can I? 
over, uh, like do the do the walking off stream or something. You're probably in the next quest item, as it's a drop, so we have to wait for it anyway. Okay. All right, so let's fly Where back to going? Darkshire. Turn this well, in. If you're looking to get there quickly. I missed a follow earlier. Baked beans in Leet speak. Thank you for the follow, by the way. <laughs> They're taking the hobbits to Raven Hill. Hill, hill, hill. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. What's up, pie boy? How are you doing, sir? Wow, I kind of like this curse. It gives me a dark shadow priest look to myself. Oh, I didn't do my uh, talent. Shadow spells have a chance to make them vulnerable. Yeah, I think that's what we do next. Probably not going to do the improved mind blast. The raid build, I think, would include that and not have spirit tap. Or something, I can't remember. Chance to make them vulnerable to shadow damage. And shadow form requires 30 points, so I think we get that at level... Is that level 40 or 41 we get that? You like hobbits, but you couldn't eat a whole one, Kappa. <laughs> I mean, you are a dwarf. Maybe if you were an ogre or a... One of those Urukai. If you were an Urukai orc, you could eat a whole halfling, I bet. Alright, so Paul is over here. Farming for a quest item. Taking the hump size? God, 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 God. Uh, which quest are you doing? Because we need to kill plague spreaders. Oh, you're getting those rot blossoms. Okay, yeah, I'll have to come join you for that then. Uh, it's one of those drop ones. Those are the most annoying quests. You Hopefully they are something? pretty have a high, high drop rate. So the chap did spend some time in Moonbrook after all. It is rather odd the letter. Lion's Pride in Nonetheless, I shall in Goldshire. The oh my. Yeah, I'm not doing Must that have right now. This the first <laughs> time. In the registry, right beneath the first address for Stalvin, there's another one listed, only partially scratched out. Looks like he was headed to the Lion's Pride Inn over in Goldshire. Might want to check there, adventurer. All right, let's go join for some rot blossom farming. Uh, I guess I'll put it on. Yeah, I should keep it on round robin so we just take turns. Probably for the best since we both got to get all the drops. Where do we get the rot blossoms from? Uh... Skeletal whores and skeletal fiends. So we could do this over on Ravenhill too, because those whores and fiends are all at the beginning of Ravenhill as well. Do you want to head over there then? Since we have... Yeah, yeah, let's do that. I have a feeling there's more whores and fiends over there anyway. Let's do it. All right, so rot blossoms. And we can turn in uh, the quest at Jitters. I assume you have this quest to turn in as well. Um, and we can kill the plague spreaders over there. We can try to fight level 35 Morladim Elite. It's probably a bad idea. <laughs> I don't think we're ready for Morladim unless we get... You know, if somebody in, uh, in the zone calls for uh, looking for a group, we could join them. Because if we had three or four people, we could probably do it. No, no, no. We're not going to try a level 35 elite with just the two of us. Even I'm not that crazy. And you know how crazy I am. 
Even I am not that crazy. Even I am not that crazy. Rand the Reckless. That does sound like... I would accept that. Rand the Looter. Rand the Reckless. Rand the Rager. Rand Saltmaster. I accept all these. I don't accept Heisenberg, though, and that's what I usually get, you know, so... As long as it's not Heisenberg. Alright. All my attributes are reduced by 5 from this. Wow, that curse actually does suck. I am the looter. You may call me Sir Pi Lutes the Third. <laughs> well, then you need to join us for some... Uh, Baldur's Gate 3, Pie Boy, because we do plenty of looting there. I can't bow. Can I think while moving? I can. Are you gonna aggro, bro? You are. Nice. Two flanks means I can make one of those wolf state things. Uh, Grima's back in the shower, and your cat has joined. Welcome, Grima, and your cat. What's interesting, what's interesting, in years of playing games with Rand, he's the least reckless out of the people we play with. <laughs> really? Uh, that means... Who do you play with? You play with um, Burger and all the Canadians that you play with, right? Um, Kira and who else do you play with? I don't know. I'm just... I always want to win. I like to challenge myself and win. So, like, doing these higher level quests, which it would be safer to not do, I enjoy challenging and then succeeding. But, like, I try to not go over the level of what will get us killed. Hollow is pretty nuts. You play with Hollow, yeah. Shogi, you're the most reckless. I believe that. I believe that about you, Shogi. What's you got you got to what level seven or eight when you did hardcore classic and then died? And then gave up like a quitter. You still don't have your druid or shaman healer like you talked about. <laughs> Rand likes salty wait, what's safty? I think that's salty and looting and taking lava baths. I do take some lava baths. Don't make me come back to WoW and prove you wrong. You know? I I dare you. I double dog dare you. Oh, safety. Is that what that was supposed to be? Safety. Okay. Hello, Mr. Jittery person. Hello. Safe travels. Yes, I'm the author of that book. You finally found me, eh? Well, if you the book you found was only half finished. I had to leave it at Sven's farm. Okay. Take my completed journal the to Sven. The book you found was only okay. half finished. Speak I with had Chef to leave Rual. it at Sven's okay. farm when I fled there. Here, take my completed journal to Sven. It describes more fully what happened at his farm. Although this journal has been my only company these past weeks, if giving it up keeps me from having to face Sven and his wrath, then I do it willingly. I've been stuck hiding in this ghost town for weeks, and I haven't eaten anything but grubs and weeds. I need some <laughs> decent food, and I'm willing to trade well for it. This guy's voice, when he goes up east and I'll higher in his range, just sounds goofy. And I'm down, 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 down. Alright, so we just gotta get a crap ton of these fiends and get the rot losses from these guys. Hey, I got my first one. Nice. Uh, want me to turn loot on three for all, and we split up on these. Probably faster. You finally found me, an uninterested voice. I need some decent food. Good God. Pay your voice actors, they need something to produce actual voice acting. 
Either way, okay. Um, well, it's probably safer to just group. It would probably be faster, too, since we kill faster. Well, what I will say, Madman, is these are not Blizzard paid voice actors. These are people who have done a mod. Um, to do the voice acting. You already have five? Okay, cool. Baldur's Gate 3 voice acting puts all these guys to shame. It's true. The, the, the voice acting in Baldur's Gate 3 is top tier. You're definitely right about that. That voice actor just tamming it up, yeah. Okay. Uh, ignore the grave robbers. I don't think they can drop any of our items. Where are the plague carriers, I wonder? Oh, the plague carriers are the zombies, aren't they? When there's the Pokemon, one of the most successful franchises in the world, still with silent cutscenes. <laughs> Well, I've been watching some videos about people talking about how popular Pal World is. And, um, like, the devs for Pal World are people who had never done any game developing until they started working on this game. Uh, we don't need healers, actually. Don't need healers for Rot Blossoms. Um... They're just some guys who learned how to develop a game because they wanted to play something that was fun. Because apparently it's it's still blowing up. That game is apparently super popular everywhere. This Pokemon is true to its roots with its million text boxes, huh? <laughs> You've been really enjoying uh, Power World. It's super fun and chill. Yeah. The more I hear about it, the more I kind of do want to check it out at some point. I'm not sure if I want to stream it or not. Power World is Pokemon with guns! <laughs> yeah, pretty much. We might be playing some games with Farb and Gabo tomorrow. Oh, nice! What are y'all gonna play? Is somebody streaming or are you just doing it for fun off stream? I haven't seen. Do I follow Gobbo? I feel like I never see what's his 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 full name is what Goblin Juggler, right? I feel like I never see him stream. But that might be because I don't follow him or he doesn't stream that often. I don't know which. The tabletop sim has a version of Slay the Spire board game. That's good. They're probably streaming and he might too. Sweet. That sounds fun. I remember when Shogi made me uh, download Tabletop Sim. We proceeded to play like one game and then didn't really do anything more with it. I still have Tabletop Sim because of Shogi uh, either gifting it or convincing me to get it to play a game at one point. You didn't make me do anything. You made me play all the video games and I love it. Just like I made you try City of Heroes that one time, and you didn't really like it that much. <laughs> I did that with Steven, too, with my brother Steven. I tried to get him to play uh, City of Heroes. There's that old-school superhero MMO. And the combat is just not really fun enough for modern-day gaming, it seems. He 
said I said I don't play board games. You stopped asking. That's true. I don't. I don't play a lot of board games. So that does sound like what I said. It's probably what I said. Uh, Cedar Heroes character creation is top notch, and that's that's the main reason I play it is for the character creation. But I kind of had stops too, so. I like go through phases of wanting to create more superhero characters for fun. Live Monopoly stream when? <laughs> soon, TM, soon. Time to make a Mosskin and Lurk. Mosskin, huh? What's a Mosskin? Is that a, is that a, is that a Dungeons and Dragons thing? You do love to use some board games. You play TTS with some of your board game buddies during COVID, so you have quite a few hours on it. TTS. All right, so you're done with yours. Okay, cool. Those big green things that walk around in the swamps. Oh, okay. Like the Fen Creepers. Oh. That priest is doing her farming over there, too. Paul, do you have to leave at a similar time as the last time we played? Like at the end of this part of the stream? I'm assuming that's your normal work time. Oh, you don't have to leave today. Okay, interesting. Uh, you're a board game junkie, to be honest. You're just about to get a new board game every paycheck. Really? Well, I might I, well, I might want to go finish my Westfall quest, is why I ask. Or not Westfall, uh, Wetlands quests. So after we finish these quests up, I might want to split up just to get those quests done. If you're okay with that. I have like two quests that I don't know if they'll continue to change to other quests. But I'm definitely enjoying questing together, so... If we want to find another area to quest together at some point, I'm definitely cool with that. Alright, I need some mana. Board gaming can be fun, yeah. I just... The reason I don't like board games that much is because I don't hang out with real-life friends enough. <laughs> I'm just always playing video games. So... So, really, the reason is I'm antisocial. Too busy playing video games to play board games with friends. Time to visit Rand and play some board games, yeah. Although my friend Tim, sometimes when I hang out with him and my brother, uh, he'll sometimes have a game he wants to play. Uh, there's a... There's an X-Men card game that he sometimes has gotten me to play. I forget what it's called. But that's pretty fun. Hope I have loot over there. That might be my last quest item over there, actually. Let me go see if this has my last quest item on it. Yeah. Done. So, plague bringers now. Uh, getting board games is fun. Trying to get people to play them, not as much fun. Yeah. <laughs> Does everyone have time on Saturday? Yeah, no, well, I gotta go. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Yeah. Especially when all your friends are married with kids. Yeah, that's one of the hardest. Rotted ones. Plague spreader. Yes. Plague spreaders. Yeah, 
that, so we need to go down into the crypt again, probably, here. Uh, have you heard of the game Zero of the Seas? Hmm. I have not heard that much. I'm assuming that's a fun tabletop board game. It's cool how these guys crawl out of the ground when they spawn. That's really cool. Oh, we got diseases. Depends if there's a local gaming club, if you're prepared, prepared to dramatic flair. Meet new people! Meet new people? That sounds horrifying. Who would ever want to do that? Oh, me, if I ever want to actually have a real social life. I probably should do that. So we need to kill 20 of these dudes. Oh wait, Brain Eater. You're not a plague spreader. Okay, well I guess they're mixed in here. I guess the ones we need to kill are actually mixed in here. Spamming through my mana now. Meeting Randu save up and visit a board game convention. <laughs> if I was ever to go to convention, it'd probably be like TwitchCon or something. The thing that you know all the streamers do. TwitchCon to meet up with you know other streamers and viewers and, and stuff like that. That's the that's the streamer thing to do is to go to TwitchCon, right? He either broke immediately or fall attack him. I don't know which. Oh well. This is a lot less scary than last time because we were leveled up. I'm gonna need to uh, get some mana after this fight. AoE? Really? I didn't know you had an AoE skill. Dice Throne sounds interesting. I'm not familiar with that one. You've been playing that lately. Heat Pedal to the Metal and Ready, Set, Beat. Interesting. RPG convention you go to has some board games on, and you could probably bring some along and find people to play if you wanted to. Nice. Yeah, I don't think you have AoE. The guy probably just broke immediately. It probably wasn't you. I just, you know, I always blame other people when things go wrong. That's what I do for some reason. If you touch him, does it break? No, it shouldn't touch. The only reason my Shackle and Dead should break is if you do damage. It's just like Polymorph. So the only way it should break is if somebody does damage to it. But I think sometimes it can just break early. Played some terraforming Mars Ares expedition today. Got it from 15, 15 bucks from Target. Well worth the 15 bucks, nice. All right, how many more do we need? 10 more. Rain eaters mixed with the plague spreaders. Ah, oh, he's just gonna disease me. And I'm gonna immediately cleanse it. He's gonna do it again. <laughs> like, no, you have a disease. And I say, no, I don't. Reject your reality and substitute my own. A quote Adam Savage from Mythbusters. You played Terraforming Mars once a while back, it's pretty fun. Okay. 
Brain eater, brain eater. There's a lot of brain eaters. I'm gonna random bone chewer walking around. Just avoid the brain eaters. Kill the padding, dude. When in doubt, C4. <laughs> That sounds like a quote from Command and Conquer or Red Alert or something we were talking about the other day. Got a present for you. When in doubt, C4. That's a Mythbusters quote. You're right. When in doubt, C4. Uh, Janie, Jamie Heineman says that one time, doesn't he? I think I can vividly remember that quote, I think. Vividly, I think. Very unclearly, vividly remember. I was also the motto from the Stargate SG-1 group. <laughs> Brain eater, brain eater, like better. How long have you been doing YouTube shorts and how's that going? Uh, I, I think last week was the first one time we put one up and it was Zach Dog who suggested it. Um, I think it's gone well. I'm not the best at tracking metrics and stuff, so... I don't know exactly how well it's going, but... We had at least one that was really popular for a day or two. I have a feeling these YouTube shorts are things that are going to be popular for a day and then go away. I don't, I don't know if they're just going to be super popular for all that long. But who knows. Maybe we'll get some new uh, people joining the stream through the, through the shorts. I definitely need to put the one where we got zero health today. Uh, I need to upload that clip as a short. I only need five more of these. We probably kill our way out of here after a couple more. Better than YouTube pants or YouTube one sheets. What one is easy? <laughs> Where's my YouTube Snuggie? That's what I need. Oh, there's a rare! Crap. These rares are feeling not that rare lately. I feel like I'm seeing rares all over the place. This one we can totally kill. Alright, here we go. <laughs> True. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna use my AoE that I got. I don't have a there we go. Well, that was quick. Holy crap, that's a- wait, that's minus stamina? Minus stamina plus intellect. What a crappy green. <laughs> that's terrible. That might be the first minus stat item I've ever seen. And wow, minus stamina? It is cursed. The hell? I don't think I've ever seen a cursed minus stat item before. It's crazy. Alright, these are all brain eaters. Let's kill our way out. We'll get the last plague spreaders we need, most likely. Yeah, I didn't know minus stats was a thing in WoW either. That's crazy. Only an old school WoW would they have a trolley item like that. Congratulations, you got an item. It makes you worse. Suck it. Welcome to WoW. Suck it. That's the C4 quote. Yeah. I'll click on that to watch it later. Yeah. They use that clip a lot in, in future episodes or in other episodes. 
Okay, that guy's spawning. Oh, we're in like, I think they put that quote in uh, like the intro if, for the show eventually or something. Good motto. <laughs> okay, I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna CC this. Cause this guy's gonna die fast enough. Oh my god, I got two diseases. Oh crap! This bone you were gonna aggro, he might. One, two, three. Up, oh, uh, you. Uh, that should be quest completed. Stats. Who cares about stats? Does it make you look like a distinguished gentleman? Good question. That is a good question. All right. Uh, Nightwatch, we turn in. Darkshire. Stalvin, I need to run someplace. Sven is in Darkshire. So it looks like all of our turn ins are in Darkshire. To Darkshire. Get out of here without aggroing everything. Maybe this way. Eh. Oh god! Oh god! Don't aggro other things. Me jumping over that wall messed with the uh, messed with the pathing. Look at Paul, all OP and strong, killing his mob before I can kill mine. Alright, can we get out of here? No more aggro. Okay, cool. Alright, so we need to get to Darkshire. I guess we can go... North? You've, you've passed me in OP-ness. Your OP-ness is bigger... Okay, I'll stop there. I'll stop there. All right, let's uh, let's go. I think it's better to just or faster to just run the north side. Um. Oh, is this where you got that other quest? That's where you got that other quest, isn't it? Okay. All right, leg spreaders. Stalvin's the one where I need to just go to random places. Jitters turn in, look to the stars, gather rot blossoms, this is Darkshire, Jeff Gual. Okay. Um, listen to that. It's a shame EA Sports got their advertisement phrase. It would be funnier if, wow, it's in the game. <laughs> wow, it's in the game. I mean, it, it works. It works. All right. So, a quest to kill Morladim. I think there's eventually a quest to kill Morbent Fell. Was that the guy that was in the house in there? There's like multiple M named elites in this. In Raven Hill Cemetery, I think. Is that a pun? Is that a pun? It just sounds like misrepresenting a quote. But sure. Misrepresenting a quote is what happens for me all the time, so. Well, go away. All 
Alright, so I'm wondering... When we first got here to Darkshire, I remember... What was it? This... Mistmore Mantle place. Or... What's it called? Manor Mistmantle. It was too high a level for us. I feel like we should be getting a quest to go kill there soon. R.A.P. is a Rand approved pun. Rand is rapping again. <laughs> sure. Whoa, Nightbane Morgan. There's a chest, though. Chest. Let's kill. You can grab it. Did we not have a quest for Nightbane Wargans? Or were these the same guys we were killing down there at one point? I forget. I feel like there was a quest to kill these guys that we've missed out on. Hmm. Or we did and it's just another place you can kill these guys, maybe. Stalvin is Stalvin Mismantle. Ah! Alright. So that's why Ventmi wants to get me caught up on that. Oh man, how much running simulator do I have to do for that then? I gotta go to Goldshire, then I'm gonna guess I have to go to like Stormwind or something. Man, maybe I do need to do the, the running simulator for this Stalvin quest then. I would like to do that Mismantle one if it's not too hard of an elite quest. Alright, let's go sell some stuff. Help you find something? Um, boo, 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 okay. Disenchant that. I don't want negative five stamina, thanks for asking. Oh my gosh, Mystic Farewell. Essence! Another tier above. Too much random junk. What can I do for you? On behalf of the All people right, of let me get a ten slot bag. I don't need Watch. a quiver or an ammo pouch, that's for sure. For your bravery and dedication, may the light shine upon your ways. Okay, very nice. Only our second ten slot bag. Time for a Rocky something. montage music moment. <laughs> Good, you got the rock blossoms. All right, bring the zombie juice to Abercrombie, Ab okay. Skeletons. Keeping the people of Darkshire safe is a grim burden for the Night Watch, and news that Crab others cakes. are the time Six gooey spider legs and bring them to Chef Gruel. news indeed. I actually think I Here's have juice. gooey spider legs. Be careful with this stuff. Uh, it's strong enough to raise the dead. Storm winds. You need some crab cakes, do you? Well, I might be able to cook some up for you. I'll let you in on a little secret. Dusky crab cakes are okay. really made from spider legs. Well, vent me. How about disgusting, oh. but the cakes have a nice tangy flavor and make great snacks. Nice. Bring me gooey spider legs, and I'll whip Ooh. you up a few of them. Okay. I hear venom web spiders are a good source. They nest to the north, between the foothills and the river. Okay. Um, I got a plan. Paul, do you have the dusky dusky crab cakes? If you want to go kill the gooey spider leg things. I'm going to go to Stormwind. Because I think I might have Where some of those like in my bank. To? I'm going to go by Goldchar okay. for the Sven whatever it's called. Stalvin quest. And I'm going to do some walking simulator to get caught up with Stalvin for, to do that. Because I kind of do want to do the Miss More stuff. Miss Mantle, Miss More. Okay. Perfect. Real like break, do your morning run? Sounds great. I'll do a running sim and other stuff. Uh, I can throw these Mr. Mystic Essences and Lester. I'm just going to throw these into the bank, I thought. I'm not even close to being able to use them, it seems. My enchanting is behind. Time for some running simulator chat. Put this in the bank. Oh, I wanted to make one of those. I need to disenchant that. So much random crap. Light path simulator, that's right. 
Followed by a montage of me running from one end to the next for this Stalin quest. Just scribble down the crab cake recipe. Oh, let me just take a look. Okay, thanks. Okay, I'm not going to make that. I'm not going to do that work for you. Thanks for asking. I think I have another turn in. Yes. The guy at the cheese place. I have a, I have a couple turn ins to, sto to do in Stormwind, so we'll do all of the turn ins. And see if I have gooey. Gooey crab legs, is that what it is? Goo gooey spider legs? Those things. Pretty sure I kept those on purpose because I knew there was some cooking recipe for it. So hopefully I have six of them. <laughs> and there's a recipe command if you want to learn how to make the gooey chocolate chip cookies. Can I help you? Yeah, this is an interesting read. I have Dashiell Stone Fist in, in Old Town. Okay. Alright, we're this? gonna we're definitely doing some Stormwind Goldshire yeah. now that running simulator, it, folks. So get Dashiell. ready for fun. Dashell something. What was his name? Fist. Dashell Stone Fist. They call him Fist in some circles. Probably on account that he likes to get in brawls. You can find him he in likes Old to Town, fist usually. Uh, I don't know, he fights. In the yeah, that's, it. that's probably Go what talk it is. To he's him. a fighter. If you have to, use a sword or something heavy and blunt to right. persuade him what to open up some. What does it take to do an upgrade? Hesitate. If he's in this as deep as these papers suggest, then he's not going to give you any information willingly. Okay, this bag thing, I don't know how to actually upgrade my bags in, in this. How do I buy a slot? Yes! Gooey spiderling legs. Gooey spider legs. I'm going to take all of them, actually. That lets me... How do you buy with the baggy thing? I don't know how to buy a bag slot. Right click to solve your around. bank now. No one's ever stolen anything out of here. Not in the I, I don't know how to do it, so... History. Just throw this bag in here. One day I'll figure out how to actually expand my inventory. Disenchant this. Oh, well, I want to throw that into. It. Welcome to the Bank of Stormwind. Let me we combine those safety deposit or boxes for uncombine, so I have less inventory have space being taken up. No one's ever stolen anything out of here. Not in the whole history of the whole history. Light bless you. <laughs> yeah, whoever did that voice acting. Took a lot of time, that's for sure. I need to make this wolf flank. Do I have a cooking thing around here? Maybe instead here. Why did you say Rand no, Taters? What did I do? Did I do something? Okay, so there's a guy in Old Town. I need to talk to Dashell Stonefist. I need to run down to Goldshire. That that will probably bring me back to Stormwind, but who knows? I almost made a naughty joke. Oh, <laughs> that's why he's saying no. Don't make a naughty joke. No, don't do it. I wonder how long. Yeah, and the voiceovers. What's crazy is like I have a feeling there's only like one or two dudes that did all the guy voices and only one or two dudettes, ladies. Whoever who did the uh, women's voices. Now, let's see, there's a guy around here somewhere. Am I supposed to go in the middle there, I wonder? Lenny Fingers McCoy. There he is. What? You come into me alley and ask questions about me personal business? Yes, business, I did. Which you obviously have nothing to do with. Yeah, All right, defeat him. not the smartest person to come to store. Yeah. Huh. One of the dumbest to yeah. believe. Yeah. I don't know if I actually win this fight. Uh... Okay, does he call him off? Okay, we beat him. Are these guys still fighting me? 
Okay, I think they... I think they gave up. No boss. No, no problem, boss. Do they despawn? Are they gonna aggro? Okay, good. <laughs> that would be ridiculous if I die to a quest spawning noob dude zombie and that kills me. That would be insane. So, yeah. Um, All right, back to him, okay. I might know something about that meeting at Adelstead. That is a different voice from the guy who just said, You walk up to me? That's totally a different voice. Oh man, this voice acting. This voice acting. And they use the guy with the super deep voice to be that seven year old child voice actor. It's crazy. Alright, Lion Heads, or Lion's Pride in. That's the uh, little chair one. That voice add on rules, you love it. It's it's great, but it's also kind of goofy with some of the choices they made. The choices. Yeah. My pleasure. My pleasure. All right, turn this quest in. Oh, this is gonna give us level twenty nine, isn't it? Good to see you're still alive. Man. Ding, baby. So it went. Mikhail in the wetlands. Uh, okay. I've well, been reading up more that would be really annoying if I wasn't already planning on going there later. The name of the diplomat they were after. It does talk about this plan B they enacted uh, after failing on their first attempt to capture him. This slim that shadow weeding. Have any other that will unlock there, vampiric embrace next Menethil. next level, I believe. A level thirty will get vampiric embrace. Nice. In the wetlands at the harbor city of Menethil. Ding 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 ding. You tell him you're working for me. His name is Mikhail. Right, I need to you mention this thing. Who's going to take you over to Duskwallow Marsh too? Oh jeez. Well, that's you just take a boat over there, right? This kidnapped diplomat. We need to find out Duskwallow Marsh. Or at least who is that? The Theramore Isle thing? The yeah. Mention anything about I, there's a quest to actually take the boat over there anyway that I never did, so I guess I could do that. Yeah, we hit 29. One away from halfway to 60. And we were, I'm going to keep showing this. We were this close from dying. This close from dying. I need to capture that and use that as, as the uh, thumbnail. Just, just bit of, put a big circle, like zoom in and circle. How are we not dead? That's, that's the... That's the YouTube thumbnail. Alright, Goldshire is right down here. Pretzel, what a great name. Alright, where is this quest gonna take us next, I wonder? Let me cook before I forget. I'm going to go inside this inn and cook. Before I do the quest and forget. I just want to get this uh, wolf flank turned into something so it's not stacked in my inventory. Okay. Where is a place to cook? Can I cook here? Can I cook at a cozy fire? Yes, I can. Nice. Welcome to my inn, weary traveler. What can I do? Salvan, sounds familiar. I remember now. Sounds familiar. Um, man ran down the stairs screaming, his face pale with fear. He forgot his letters in the chest. came in, seeking refuge for the night. One remains from that Salvan fellow in front of the canal district. Ran down the stairs screaming, his face pale with fear. Still wearing his bedclothes, he disappeared into the downpour. Chest upstairs. In his haste, he forgot his letters in the chest upstairs. He never returned for them. One remains from that Stalvin fellow, intended for the canal district in Stormwind. Help yourself to it. Is there, is there a chest up here? You just left it in the chest? You didn't, like, have a... Where's your inn lost and found? That's what I want to know. There it is. And then we take it to Stormwind, right? Yeah. All right, where do we take this? Intended for the canal districts. Can I read the letter to know where I'm supposed to take this? Uh, your 
Word of your need for a tutor for children has reached me here in Goldshire. Uh, I was forced to abandon my post as headmaster at the Moonbrook Schoolhouse. Headmaster Krillian of the Academy can speak to you of my abilities. Where am I supposed to go? Sylvan Mismantle. There's the Mismantle. Thing. Or Stalvin. Service tutor of your offspring. Headmaster Krillian of the Academy can speak to you. I think that might be up in the Cathedral distri District. There's like some orphans or something. I think it might be that. Scam the YouTubers by calling it death number three with that video. <laughs> yeah, I might do one of those like clickbait titles. Third death question mark and have it with that uh, with that with that screen capture with with the with the health low health uh, circle. That's that's a great clickbait title. Great idea, Suda Drifter. I'll have to do that. It'd be a little more work, but that should be pretty easy to, to screen cap that real quick. Up pretty easily. What can I do for you? The Traveler. That's a cool name. And you know what? Because I don't want to look it up. Um... Legend of Stalvin Undelivered Letter. I'm just going to look this up real quick. Legend of Stalvin. West. Canal District. Um... Somebody in the comments going to tell, right? Uh, head to Stormwind to find Kertok or Falsum, who's located at the dead end of the path on the edge of the canal west of the south entrance in the park. Oh, well, that's not where I was thinking it would be. Okay, I'm glad I looked that up. I'm cheesing, chat. Cheesing the quests. Don't want to run around Stormwind for an hour. Uh, edge of the canal west of the south entrance to entrance into the park. Okay. Probably about the right level for a uh, stockade run too. But with my almost death today, probably I should avoid doing any dungeons that will get me killed. Aha, there it is. Thank you, Wowhead. Thank you. Uh, person named 43758 for doing that. Oh, somebody's actually doing that. <laughs> you need something? Uh, what do you got there? Let me take a look. You've got some nerve bringing you. <laughs> some nerve! <laughs> My father was the caretaker of the estate long before. Uh, I last funds of the Flint Bridge have dried up. up I guess if you're really going to learn. Okay. Here nor Search there. the package. The last funds Packed of the up Flint possessions. Am I going to get attacked now by the this spear of the too? Family possessions are headed for auction. Blame the tax vultures. I guess if you're going to get to page you discover, provide your, your next clue. Who knows what you might find? They're not the demands of the past! <laughs> Oh, we have that 10 minute minus attribute thing again, damn it. Right, what do we got here? Um, East Vale Logging Camp in Elwyn, close to the Red Ridge Mountains. Okay. Wow, this definitely is our walking simulator quest. That is for damn sure. And I can't decurse that, right? No. Oh, nice! That druid just decursed me. Ha ha ha! Awesome. Oh, that's like a pally healing helmet. Nice. Wow, can he craft that? It's a pretty good item. Level 23. Ed uh, Edlardo, what a name. Edlardo. 
Good. Everybody gets buffs. Buffs for everybody. Nice. Blessing of wisdom. Beautiful. Okay. Enchanter looking for work. Wow. People actually... Yeah, I guess... Who all 60? There is one 60... Level 60 on the entire server that's online right now? Surely that's not right. Who 60? There we go. Okay. Oh, I guess because there was I put all. So there are 32 level 60s on the server. I wonder I wonder how much raiding goes on on the hardcore server. So I know there's some there's at least some that goes on. I've seen a streamer who does it. That's pretty crazy to me. Alright. So we're supposed to go to uh, arrange for a marriage. Company of the family to their summer cottage near the East Vale logging camp in Elwyn, close to the Red Ridge Mountains. So it's like over here, I think. I keep meaning to sell these potions. I have higher level potions. I got six gooey or twelve gooey spider legs, so I can actually give. It only takes six for my quest. I can actually give the other six to Paul if he wants to do this quest. And if he doesn't want to do this quest, I can probably make some more gooey spider cakes. Someone intentionally got their entire hardcore raid group killed, killed on Kilthazad and Nax just for the lols. Were they streaming? Because if they're going to do that. I feel like the only reason you do that is you're trying to make content. Was somebody streaming when it did that? Because that's insane. To screw over your entire raid group like that. That would get you so blacklisted you'd never get another group again, I feel like. Was that on this server or the other server? I don't Because we're on, what, Skull Rock? I don't know what the other hardcore server is called. He's either streaming or they made a YouTube video after. People are pretty mad. Yeah, no kidding. What size raid is that for Nax? Is that 20 or 40? If that's a 40-man raid, getting a 40 max level characters on a hardcore server killed for the lulls is it's just the epitome of video game evil. Why you have to be so mad? It's only a game. Yeah, let's uh, let's if while we're doing this running simulator, at least unlock all the map uh, locations as we go. I think it's gonna be up here or over here somewhere that we gotta do this next quest. Nax is 40, and you have to have geared up through my uh, Molten Core, Blackwing Lair, and EQ to even raid Nax. Or AQ, is that Encourage to even raid Nax? That's insane, man. The amount of hours somebody... Wow. There's got to be some sort of punishments or something for something like that. Like getting banned from Hardcore Server or something like that. Although I guess the uh, downside that would be how can you... Prove it unless there's posts, video evidence or something. They could say it was just an accidental wipe. I wonder how many just raid wipes there's been on any of the hardcore servers. It's not even purposefully done. I do not remember the... Uh, Elwyn Forest quest that much. I didn't do much human questing. 
The only human I ever leveled up was a single human mage in like classic or burning crusade or something. Before night elves could be mages. Because if night elves could have been mages on launch, it would have been a night elf mage. Every character I make would be a night elf. <laughs> The only reason I ever made a character that was not a Night Elf was when I was had to play Horde because I was playing with some people on Horde, or it was a class that could not be a Night Elf like a mage way back when. Right, here's the logging camp. And there's some cottage. Oh, is it this cottage right here? I think it might be this over here. The summer home of somebody. Okay, and that guy I could kill. I don't want to do that. Am I supposed to talk to you? The Defias gang in Northshire no. wears burlap masks, but the Defias in Elwyn wear linen, which I can use to make fine uh, linen. Goods. I don't care about learning Bring me red stuff. linen bandanas, and I'll use them to What's fashion this video? something for you. Best cardboard Defias raid gang members group have wiped by troll. Throughout All right, I'll have to read that uh, article later. Uh, ah, I bet it's that. Up there, well. Oh, this is where you get your uh, your human mount. I forgot about this. The horse mounts are here. What's up, Nordra? How are you doing? Marshall Haggard. Why you look so haggard, lol? What can I do for you? Go with honor, friend. All right, put on my hands. I can't see it. My eyesight is bad. I can barely make out those letters. Running style reminds me of something. Me of something I once saw before my vision became Check upstairs so for the faded journal page. There was a bundle of parchments in the chest upstairs when I moved into this place. I looked the at the legend once of Starvin. But I gave up once the fog hazed over my peepers. Fog old, hazed over my peepers. Man Who favor, talks like that? You're wearing a friggin' for eye patch. That might help you in your quest to discover more about this Stalvin character. I'm pretty sure. Oh, this lady again. I'll help in any way I can. Let the legend of Sullivan rest. No, you die. But could you stop cursing me though? Because I really don't like it. Cursing's rude. So could you effing stop effing cursing for the love of F? Please. Alright. Here, I brought you the papers, old man. Need help? Go with honor, friend. You found it! I sure did! I know of someone who might be able to assist you. Uh, Scarlet Raven Tavern in Darkshire. Garden, I used to get drinks Smits. at the Scarlet Smits. Raven Tavern Smits. in Darkshire. The okay. innkeeper there, Smits, was quite an expert okay, on the local that. lore. Show him this page and see what he has to say about it. Looks to me you've seen quite a bit of combat in your time, adventurer. If you haven't already, you should. Okay, so this might finish this running simulator part of the quest, hopefully. Be God, winch! <laughs> yes, winch. I'm not a winch, I'm your wife. But after, after what you just said, I don't want to be that anymore. Name that movie. Name that movie. I know Shogi would know it. Alright, let's see here. Too easy. Yeah, it is too easy, isn't it? You gonna name it? It's too easy. I'm gonna give you the Jeopardy sound soon. Do, 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 do. Nobody's gonna say it? <laughs> you don't even want to say it, it's so easy. <laughs> You're holding back your useless movie knowledge right now. Princess Bride. Nice, well done, Taters. Well done. That is correct. That is correct. How about that one? Saying that is correct is from another movie from the 90s. And I'll give you a hint. It's an Adam Sandler movie. Anyone know know that? 
and I'm saying it in the voice that the character says it. That is correct. Can anybody get that one? Hmm? Alright, I checked you earlier. Do you Time is money, friend! Oh, goblin jumper cables, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Billy Madison, yes! Ellie Sharome got it. Chris Farley's character in Billy Madison. Miss Chris Farley, yeah. Uh, the scene where uh, uh, Adam Sandler and Chris Farley, Chris Farley's testing him, and he does his, like, sh strip his shirt off and fluffs out his hair. He's being all, I don't know, sexy, goofy. Happy, Gilver is, ha Happy Gil Gilmore is your favorite uh, Sandler movie. I watched Happy Gilmore almost every day one summer in high school with my friend Drew. We would watch that like every night after hanging out all day. I love Happy Gilmore. Shut up, Happy. So many good scenes and lines from that movie. Tommy Boy's your all-time favorite. Tommy Boy's amazing. Level 30 dudes up there. Okay. We've only just begun to live. He just starts singing in Happy's Happy Place. Tommy Boy's peak 90s comedy. You never cared for Black Sheep? I'm trying to remember Black Sheep. Which is the one where he's trying to get voted into office or something? Is that Black Sheep? Tommy Boy is the one where he's like a salesman, right? And there's another one where he's trying to get voted into office or something. All right, hopefully our running simulator days are about to be done for now. Hello. Sell this, sell this. See you around. Do, 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 do. All right, The Legend of Stalvin. By the light. You bet I recognize that handwriting. I followed the legend of that Stalvin um, character for years. Muddy Page to Commander Ebenlong. Cool. were slaughtered a few years cool. back. I went with Haggard to investigate. I found these muddy pages, but we were never able to link the handwriting to that All right, crazy return to Jader. Jader's with the Dusk Your Crab Cakes. We can learn. Oh, man, I need... Ebenlock immediately and fill her in on what you All right, I'm going to make one of these. Ah, uh, yes, a nice clutch of legs uh, you have there. Let me just get these seasoned with my secret spices. No looking. And get them to skittering on a skillet. Oh, I need while. one skill up to be able to learn this. I'm one cooking away. I won't give out the recipe. Here's the All right, recipe I need to get two, two lean and here we are. Crab cakes wolf gruel. flanks or whatever. I need to learn this recipe. I need to make spider legs and tell people it's crab legs or whatever. What can I do for you? Safe travels. All right, here you go. Muddy My, journal pages. You have proved yourself to be quite a detective adventurer. I have had my eye on Creep Stalvin. Show Clerk Daltrey the bloodstained journal page. page written by the same hand, it proves his guilt beyond a shadow of a doubt. Uh, Black Sheep, his brother, days, is running for registry, office, Daltrey and he's the embarrassing to the campaign. Yeah. Is that the one where Rob Lowe is his brother or something? That of the Rob Lowe is in one of those Why, yes, movies. The writing on this page does, in fact, match that of the registry signature. Commander Evanlock. Okay. Evanlock, no Black Sheep was a kind of spiritual sequel to Tommy Boy. Yeah. Were correct. I knew it. Fine work, adventure. All right, kill Stalvin, Miss Stalvin Mantle, and show Madame Eva Innocent his family ring. Died by his hand. Undoubtedly, he is guilty of countless crimes. Now the lunatic threatens Darkshire. All right, the it's not elite, but it is red to me. <laughs> Travel to his cottage just north of town, all adventurer, right. and execute Stalvin. Um, once and for all. to Sven with Jitter. Where's Sven? Done, travel to Madame Eva's and show her his family ring. After all. It was her premonition spend. that he over led here to somewhere? this gruesome discovery. But Darkshire is safer because of her. Who is Sven? Which guy is Sven? He's not that Amber Crombie guy, is he? Who even is Sven? God. Uh, Sven. Sven's revenge. Return to Sven. Oh, Sven is the guy... Sven is the guy at this camp over here. Jeez, there's so much running around. Okay, um, what I'm gonna do is... I'm gonna kill wolves to get the, uh... Lean wolf flanks I need to train to learn this. 
I'm gonna go turn in these crusty crab cakes, crab legs, whatever, and I'm gonna turn in the Sven's thing. More walking simulator. Red is the color of love, also applies, applies to WoW. Um, not sure what that red reference is to. I bought an elixir of water breathing for when I was uh, doing some quests in the wetlands trying to farm. Uh, iridescent pearls from the, the clams and never got them. But uh, the two quests I have left in the wetlands, I'm going to probably go do after I finish up in Darkshire. Oh, the red quest. That's what you're talking about. Yes, sorry. Quest is red. You are correct. Sorry, stream delay. As a warrior, he did warrior damage over time rend ability. Alright, cool. If I get one more of these, that's all I'll really need. One more lean wolf flank, please. Nice. Okay. Alright, good. Let's make the long run over here, then the run down to here. And then, if Paul is not back by then, I might hearth to wetlands to do those last two quests that I have. That'll be the plan for now. I'm definitely not trying to solo Morladim or Stalvin Mismantle, that's for sure. Uh, and I do got to talk to a guy in the wetlands. And that might be the one that then I have to take a boat over to the other side of uh, whatever it's called. Um, Duskwallow Marsh or whatever. One of them is famous for one-shotting lobies. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. When we first went to... Raven Hill Cemetery, he chased us out one time when me and Paul were leveling over there. He definitely chased us out of there once. Or maybe his Morbin fell. I don't know. There's two scary elites over in Raven Hill. Uh, and I wonder if Delivering this juice is going to be <laughs> the quest text. Here's your zombie juice, and be careful. It's strong enough to raise the dead. That's uh, I think we're gonna maybe spawn patches. Is that the? Uh, that's that's what it's supposed to let you know. It's the uh, the big hint that what you're doing might not be all on the up and up, and a smart thing we should be doing. Foreshadowing! That's right. <laughs> uh, raise the dead, you say? Yes, raise them. Raise and pillage the dead. Um, let's see here. So, this seasoned wolf kebab should get us level 110, which should allow me to learn gooey spider cakes. Which then I can turn these other gooey spider legs into... Oh, uh, the crab cakes or whatever. If I want to do that. Six stamina and spirit. My best food is six stamina spirit, the seasoned wolf kebab. Cool. All right, this guy should be right up here, over this hill, I think. Yep. All right, patches or stitches or whatever your name is. You know what, I'm gonna give everybody a warning. Uh, well, let me see if he actually does it first. How are you? 
I need that zombie juice to keep me warm on these dark, cold nights. Did you get it for me? A thousand thanks, adventurer. You with warm your an old man's heart with your foolish... I mean, with your kindness. <laughs> Here you are, friend. Take this as a token uh, of my Uh, one of the ghouls don't eat me. In fact, it's just a pack so of bone chewers. Of Turn on the walls. It's a wonder the ghouls and the walking an effigy. dead haven't eaten me. Ghoul in fact, ribs. just okay. yesterday, it's not a yet. pack of not bone yet. chewers was pounding on the walls of my house. I want to make an effigy, a kind of scarecrow for ghouls. To do that, you I finish your run, you'll jump in the shower and be ready in five. Okay, cool. Flesh eaters, bone chewers, brain eaters, rotted ones, and plague spreaders. Get the ribs for me, and I will repay you with some coin. All right. This is fine, dot JPEG. That's right. Totally not going to spawn an evil monstrosity that will kill all the lobies in the zone. Totally not going to do that. You got a quest to kill him? Because I think some, like, lower level NPCs spawn to help fight him. But I don't know if you ever actually get a quest to kill Stitches or not. Come on, the guy's just cold and lonely. Help him make a friend. He just needs a friend. <laughs> An evil monstrosity stitched together from dead bodies and bones and pus. But he just needs a friend. Alright. I'll probably start working on killing those ghouls. Um... Legend of Stalvin is Stalvin is red. I wonder if we can duo that one. All right, Sven, here you go. This journal explains much to me and sets me on the path against the dark oh. riders. I have Morbent seen Fell. Riders okay, this leads to Morbent Fell. I've seen okay. Them speak with the wizard Morbent Fell at the Forlorn Road. Morbent Fell is a necromancer and an ally to the dark riders. Uh, I'm gonna hold off on killing the these guys. I'm gonna work on the ghoulish effigy since that's that the rare drop one. First well, knowing your rare, but you have already proven your bravery. Getting drops from mobs. But if you truly wish to face the necromancer, then you must now prove your skill against his minions. Oh, I bet you you make something that weakens the 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 elite dude, don't you? I bet you there's a way to weaken Morbin Fell. And when I went in there earlier. That was me being stupid going in there before we have the thing that makes him weaker. Okay, where's more let him? I don't see him, okay. Clear for right now. All right, I'm gonna go work on, I assume it's killing any of these guys to get the, um, get the ghoul ribs or whatever it is. You don't find more than him. He finds you. It's true. It's true. Bone chewers. Flesh eaters, bone chewers, brain eaters, rotted ones. Okay, so basically any of these. I can get it from any of these guys. Cool. Take your pound of flesh. It's pound of flesh, is that like a Sh Shakespeare reference? Does Shakespeare have some quote about taking a pound of flesh? I feel like that's from some famous something. Famous Shakespeare play or something. I'm out of range. From Merchant of Venice. Okay. Okay. I'm not good on the, uh, you know, classic literature knowledge. But that's good to know. Merchant of Venice. Thanks, Big Bad Eric. Thanks for telling me that. <laughs> okay. Oh, 
freaking little worms. They eat away at my inner fire. Right, I'm gonna go fight the harder ones because I don't want them to spawn those little wormy boys. <laughs> Although they do have, make me have to cleanse my disease, which is annoying as hell. Alright, I'll give you a buff. Will you buff me, please? Thank you. I'll even cleanse ya. Be super nice and cleanse ya. Feel death creeping around this place, finally. Well, we did almost die earlier, and she just pulled two. Uh, I'm gonna help her. I'm gonna help her a bit here. Uh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't turn in... You know what? Before I work on this some more. If Paul's coming to join anyway. I'm gonna go turn in... Uh... What you call it? Crab legs or whatever. The jitters. Crab cakes. A la Gruwal. Turn that one in. And we can meet up. Meet up with our rogue friend. <laughs> Thanks for the renew. <laughs> How are you doing, Vine Leaf? Hope you're doing well. I wonder if he's got a cooking place over here that I can make, make this uh, last. Seen these wolf kebabs. I could have done that probably at Sven's place. Yep. And Jitters and Sven, if you need. So we're all, so hopefully we're all in the same quests. Hello. All right. Aha. Thank you, adventurer. Those really hit the spot. All and right. here. Please let me pay you Is for there these. There's a cooking fire in here that's working, I wonder. Yep. On Stalvin kill quest. No, I guess they uh they don't let you cook here, do they? Damn. You can like make a cooking fire, but you have to actually have materials for that. that Nobody got time to carry that stuff around. All right. Um, let's see. Can we duo duo Stalvin? It's not elite, so maybe. I'm up for trying it. I'm up to try it. Stalvin is scary, be super careful. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't know. We we've run away. It's 35. So hopefully 29 plus 30 equals up more than 35, hopefully. There's more let in, by the way. Put the skull on him. Alright. Uh I'm Killing the ghouls for after the, what is it called? After the juice turn in. Okay. 
We did kill that 32 rare elite earlier, although that was also the one where I got basically one health and then almost died, so we'll have to be very careful if we try to do stall it. Hopefully we can not fight him with other adds attacking us, but he might be one of those like warlock dudes that summons extra enemies or something. Which is always super annoying. some zombies to loot when you get here. Because I am unable to loot these, so I assume. That's because, uh... I need to get closer. Vent me is in range! Just back away from the spider. Back away from the spider. Although, you know what? I'm gonna kill spider for gooey spider legs. For cooking stuff. I have extra spider legs if you need for Jitter's quest. I wonder why it is that only showing the H hit points on stuff on mouse over. Can there still be no add-on that expands UI? I believe that'd be helpful. I don't know. There might be a way, but I don't want to go hunting. I, I mean, every time I think about trying to look at it, I look at this and go, I don't know where it would show health bar numbers or percentages. Like this, this mod options is so overwhelming. That I, I just don't know where it would be, and then I look in the UI options, and I don't see anything that's like health numbers show or something. So I just don't know. I need to find Sorry, sorry. I turned off so you didn't hear me blowing my nose. Uh, the Druid Cave on Darnassus is really sketchy solo. I would only do it if you have a friend. Yeah, I turned off my mic when I was, you know, clearing my sinuses. Okay, I'm 
Remember to take breaks. I know. We have one more break to take. I'm going to finish this quest. And then talk about if we want to do Stalvin and probably take the break before Stalvin if that's what we're going to do. Because I do need to take one more break today for sure. I swear this damn ghoul crypt, we've hung, we keep coming back to it. Favorite leveling area, apparently. to achieve cookies. <laughs> That's a, another great reminder. I'm going to do it this way. I'm just going to start the poll by doing this. <laughs> that way we don't have a double pull. Somehow you're reminded of skeletal whores we fought earlier. <laughs> Just because I'm bad at pronouncing things. Don't don't talk crap about those skeletons. Don't be me. <laughs> and we've had more company in here lately. Last couple times we've come in here. Alright, four of seven ribs. Delicious prime ribs. Oh, leg spreader. No, plague spreader. <laughs> I didn't say leg spreader. That's what reminded you of the horrors. Okay. God. Oh, do I need to buff you? No, you still have your buff. Good. Oh, nice. Only need two more. Two more ribs for me. Oh uh, yes, here's my uh, here's my talents. Basically all shadow. Basically all shadow. Like I'm sure most leveling priests do. We have spirit taps, we get uh, bonus regen after anything we get a killing blow on. Proof Shadow Word Pain, of course. Uh, reduces their chance to resist. Mind Flay, of course. Psychic Stream Upgrade, which will save this once or twice. Increase the range of our shadow spells. And I'm working on Shadow Weaving, but we'll get Vampiric Embrace next, next level, I believe. Nice and toasty hot stream it was. Oh wait, things disgusting. Horrors, fishing, and leg spreaders. Okay. <laughs> that spicy stream. And Paul, my rogue friend here, is being kind enough to let me to get the killing blow so I get the uh, mana regen. Buffing need to drink.
Oh wait, my buff is somebody's higher level one that they gave me. No wonder. Damn it! Double buffed you. Annoying. Feel free to solo. <laughs> if you want to solo a dude, you're plus two. Let's see the rogue do his thing. Solo. Start with a backstab or a... What is... Is it am No, ambush is the... Is ambush the out of stealth stun... Man, I forget. It's been too long since I've played Vanilla Rogue. Do they add out of stealth stun or the um, out of stealth big damage dealing ability? Ambush is in stealth. Yeah, but does it stun or does it just do a big amount of damage from behind? I can't. Remember. Diseases for everyone, Brain Eater says. Diseases for everyone. Ah, uh, don't resist me, bro. Yeah. Yeah, it's always fun duoing with when you're a rogue because if somebody else has got the aggro, you can just backstab as much as you like. Nice. One more rib for me. More diseases. Killed him before he diseased me. I can't deny it. Does this go a long way with fours and leg spreaders going around? Oh, God. Oh, God. Don't do drugs, kids. Wait, is that what we're talking about? I don't even know. Okay, a couple disease cures. Make our way back out. Hopefully we can get a couple more ghoul ribs. Ghoul ribs. I love that spawning coming out of the ground. It's so great. I think this is the last quest we need to spawn stitches. That'll be the fun thing. Spawn stitches. Make everybody get killed because we spawn stitches. Patches. Whichever one it is. Done with ribs for me. I guess Paul needs like two or three more. Two more? Okay. But drugs effectively deal with pain like FDL. Oh wait, you said the other word that I'm not going to say because I... Because <laughs> I'm not salty, so I don't need to curse at video games. I only need to curse at video games when I'm salty at them. And even if I die in WoW, I feel like I wouldn't be as salty as I would be when I get hit by a single missile in FTL. I don't know why FTL just does it to me like that. FTL just hits harder. All right. Oh, there we go. Only need one more. Cool. Nice. 
Alright, quest is done. Alright, let's get out of here. Man, there's no good way to get out of here. And I just aggroed that. Great job. FTL just gets on my nerves with its trolling. It definitely does. Make up patches. Okay, something spawn. Let's go do it. Abercrombie and Fitch, bro. I like girls that wear Abercrombie and Fitch. to you. Pick if I had oh, one wish. We'll do just the trick. A few weeks ago, I was. Oh, uh, it's not done. House and a band of ogres attacked me. Oh, I, ran, I do know where these ogres are. Okay. Crate of precious tools and herbs. Okay. Um. Me off, the ogres swaggered back to the ogre mound. Need to Southern take my last my break. Somewhere near the mound. So yes, let's GG cookie time. We got that quest done. I miss it sorely. I know where the ogre quest is, so I'm gonna AFK, go invisible, take a little bit of a break, and when we come back. We'll do a last couple of quests and maybe do. Maybe do Stalvin, but GG cookie time. I'll be back in a bit, my friends. Y'all rock. <laughs> 